My name is Rebecca Auer, and I'm a cancer surgeon and translational researcher at the Ottawa Hospital. My research program is focused on understanding why cancers come back after complete surgical removal and how to prevent this from happening. Specifically, we're learning how to use the patient's own immune system to seek and destroy the microscopic leftover cancer cells before they have a chance to grow back. I believe the secret to happiness is profound gratitude, and no one has shown this to me better than my cancer patients. In the face of such adversity, they persevere, they fight, they fall down and they get up again. They find strength in their loved ones. They accept and they endure. And despite it all, they take the time to say thanks. It is humbling and it is inspiring. They drive me to try harder, to work longer, to probe deeper, and to keep pushing forward. They also remind me to slow down, take a deep breath, and contemplate. We are bound together by hope, and that is a powerful medicine. Leading cancer research has put cancer therapy on the precipice of a major transformation, and that is cancer immunotherapy. For a long time, we have known that the immune system, when engaged, has the ability to destroy cancer cells in much the same way that it can destroy virally infected cells. But cancers have evolved many ways to evade the immune system's attacks by putting on the brakes. Using what we've learned about how the immune system recognizes and kills viruses, we have designed a virus-based cancer vaccine. In this strategy, we harvest cancer cells from a patient's tumor, infect them with an oncolytic virus expressing an immune-stimulating protein, and then give this back to the patient as a vaccine. The virus helps stimulate the immune system, essentially pushing on the gas and steering the immune system to attack the cancer cells. In doing so, it creates an immunity against the cancer. It is a personalized cancer vaccine, and we plan to deliver it after surgery to prevent cancers from coming back. We're excited because to date, studies in mice indicate that this approach can destroy even large tumor deposits, resulting in cure. Right now, our research team, in collaboration with Dr. John Bell, is developing the oncolytic vaccine platform for use in humans. We're taking tumors from the operating room to study how best to manufacture this vaccine and to determine which viruses are best to use to infect the cancer cells. We're getting close, and we have committed to having a product ready for clinical trials in the next two to three years. This is a very aggressive timeline, but supported by Dr. Bell, the Ottawa Hospital, and the community, including all of you. I know that with hard work and with hope, we can deliver.